In 7 on your side, health matters now. Summer is winding down, of course, but allergy sufferers really aren't getting much relief. Oh, in fact, some people say that their allergies are actually getting worse. Here to explain some of this is now Dr. Sally Juvali. She's an assistant professor of pediatrics at Georgetown University School of Medicine and also you work with allergies as a specialty. I do. I'm this an allergist. Is, this is a brutal time of the year. <laughs> it can be for everybody who has fall allergens. What's happening out there that's making it so bad mm -hmm. this time? Well, most people are aware of tree pollen allergies and grass allergies, which occur in the spring and early summer. This time of the year in the fall, we have ragweed allergy, which is a predominant pollen that's blowing out there. And then we also have some mold allergy and a little bit of grass that still kicks up in the fall. Mm. So what can we do, doctor, to get some relief? We all know about the mm -hmm. typical, you know, Claritin, Allegra. Is that what you suggest? Or are there other things that we can do to help out? Well, there's a couple of different things. One is preventative. So what you want to do is make sure that you keep your windows closed. When you come inside, go ahead and shower, wash your hair, get all that pollen off of you. Uh, something else that you can do is actually use medications, but if that's not enough, you may want to see an allergist, find out what it is that you're allergic to so that you can individualize your medication. If the medication's not working, then you may want to think about immunotherapy, which is a more permanent form of treatment. Is it just more of an irritant, or is there something more severe and more dire that we need to be on the lookout for? Unfortunately, for some patients who are not allergic, it can act as an irritant because one individual ragweed plant can actually release up to a billion particles of pollen. <laughs> oh, so with all of that being inhaled through your nasal passageways, yes, it can be irritating, but it's actually an IgE-mediated immune reaction that your body's having, and that's why you get inflammation in your eyes, your nose, your chest, and so you get all that mucus production, congestion, sneezing, itching, so it's an immune reaction, so unfortunately it can get here. Mm. And I know you work with children. Any mm -hmm. different effects on kids or any other advice you have for kids who are suffering? Oh my goodness. Well, I see both children and adults, and unfortunately for children, they get mistaken for having colds, and they get treated with cold medications. So a couple of things to try to decipher that, because people can feel pretty run down, feel sick, feel like they have a sinus infection. But one of the things you want to look at is, do you have a fever? Is it something that's persisting for longer than a week? Because a cold should pretty much go away or start to get better after a week. Okay. But with allergies, They'll probably linger for weeks because we just started off the season. Unfortunately, Labor Day was kind of the kickoff. It right. started about mid-August, hit high around Labor Day weekend, and it's with us for probably the next six weeks or longer. And the symptoms can range from anything from having a, a scratch or an itch, like something that you feel like you've got mm -hmm. something on you, like poison ivy, but it's not, to actually mm -hmm. not being able to breathe real well. It can range definitely if you're getting in contact with it, and especially if you have eczema or any kind of skin condition that allows you to absorb it, it can be very itchy. For the majority of patients, you're inhaling it. So it's your nose. You may have post-nasal drip, mm. nasal congestion, sneezing. And for some patients who have asthma, it can actually set off your asthma as well. So it's very uncomfortable. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Dr. Well, Dr. Bailey, it's good having you. Yes, thank you, thank you, you very much me. for that great information. We appreciate it. Fantastic. Thanks.